Hello everyone, Carson here, and in today's video, I am going to be telling you how to make a business website for your business for free in 2021. Now, before we do get into this video, I just have to remind you to leave a like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you are notified every single time I upload. And now let's get into the content. Now, you're probably wondering how we're going to go about doing this because building a free website is not easy and it's not easy to find a good platform that's reliable and consistent and lets you host a free website. However, there is one platform that actually does meet all our criteria and is actually free as well, and that platform is Wix.com. Now, Wix is one of the best website builders on the market, undoubtedly. They offer really great services, and they're only beat out by the likes of Squarespace. But what Wix does do, unlike places like Squarespace, is they do offer an initial plan, albeit not quite fully featured, that is 100% free for their customers. So to get started on that, all you have to do is head over to Wix.com using my link down in the description. And now let's go ahead and get started with this video. Now, as you can see, I am on the Wix homepage right now. All we have to do is just hit this big get started button right here. So we're gonna hit that and then we can log in or sign up. Now I'm just gonna log in with Google because I already have a Google account, but you could log in however you want, Facebook, Google, or just actually inputting the, the data manually. Now once you sign up, it's going to go ahead and log in this page and set it up for you. So you're gonna go ahead and go to a site called Wix New Intro and it will automatically take you there after you do sign up. Now, as you can see, it just went ahead and loaded for me, so I'm gonna go ahead and hit get started. Now, as you can see, it's gonna go ahead and go to the category where we can select the category of the website we want. I'm gonna go ahead and select something like nonprofit organization blogger or business or consultant. Now, since we're building a business website, let's go ahead and type in business, and as you can see, you know, it pulls up a bunch of different business websites you can get. What we're actually gonna do is we're gonna type in local business, and then we're gonna select that right from that drop down list and hit next. Now, once you hit next, it lets you pick the features you would want on your website. I can select all the different features I would like on this site before I even get started. For example, a chat, booking, events, etc., etc. So what I can go ahead and do here is go ahead and select the things that I want, the essentially the features that I want on this website. So we've already got the website chat. We're going to go ahead and add maybe, let's see, a pricing plan. So not even a pricing plan, but let's add a blog to it and let's add add one more thing, let's say table reservations, and that should be it. Now, obviously you can pick whatever you want, but once you do that, you're just gonna go ahead and hit next. Now it just loads up and it'll ask you if you've ever created a website before. Now, if you haven't, you go ahead and select that. So let's go ahead and select that now, and you know, it'll just run it through it for you. So what we can do is it says let Wix ADI create a website for you and you can start that now if you'd like but we're gonna go ahead and choose a template instead so we can create our own Wix website. Now with the results of local businesses obviously they have a bunch of different templates that you can find and that you can pick between. Once you do find a good one that you like like let's say we like this one right here it's pretty nice pretty simple pretty clean we go ahead and hit edit. Now, once you hit edit, it will go ahead and pull up the template where you can edit your Wix template and where you can change all the settings required to edit your website. Now, the nice thing about Wix is it's super, super easy and super simple and intuitive to use. As you've seen, that entire process, you could figure that out if you needed to. Now, it does get remedially more complex once you get into the actual editor, as you will see in a second, but it's still so simple and so straightforward. Now, as you can see, we're in our Wix editor right here and we can edit everything we want. As you can see, we can change the name if we want. For example, right here, as you can see here, I can title this whatever I want like that. And then I can title this whatever I want as well. I can also just go ahead and drag it around as I want. Like, see how easy that is. I can drag it as close as I want. You know, make sure it looks good on the header. Then from here, all you do is you click this. You can click Manage Menu, and it'll let you manage the menu if you need to, you know, remove or add different pages. 
Now clicking off that again, as you can see, we can go ahead and hit this image, hit change image if we want, or we can hit this text and just hit edit text. Pretty much every feature on this web page is just drag and drop editable, which is really, really incredible. And then of course, if you want to manage your menus and pages, you just click this icon right over here. And as you can see, we've got site menu and then page transitions. So we can also have different page transitions if we would like. But from here, if we want to add a page, we can add one. If we want to remove one, we can remove one. See, we just added a new page and it automatically added to our website. Now that is pretty much all you have to do on that. It's so incredibly simple. Now, if you want to select a different page to edit, just go ahead and click this page drop down right here and select the page you want to be editing. Now, if you want to add apps to your website, go ahead and hit this add apps button right here. And you can select from the Wix marketplace of a bunch of different apps like Wix booking, Wix pricing, comments, etc. There are so many different apps you can add or manage. And as you can see, we have managed right here. So we can just go ahead and complete and upgrade or open the setup on these apps. So let's go ahead and set up our blog app, just complete setup, and then it just adds the blog to your website. So you can literally just select blog, get started, and then it will automatically add a blog page with blog posts for you. So then all you have to do is edit those and then you can also just hit manage posts from this page directly. Now, obviously, you know, once you hit manage posts, you're going to have a dashboard where you can manage all your complex little posts here. You can create a new post, you can delete them, etc. I'm just going to run you through creating a post. You add a title, you add the content, you can do SEO stuff. And then once you're done, you hit publish. That is pretty much it though on customizing your website. So once you're done customizing it and you are confident that you want to release your website, you just go ahead and hit this publish button right here. All you have to do is hit publish and then as you can see it has already published and it is live. I can click the view site button and here my site is right up on the web for free. It is literally that easy to get started with Wix.com and to build your own business website for free using Wix. It is so remedial, so intuitive, and so simple. I honestly cannot recommend it anymore if you are looking for a free business website and to design one at like no cost to you. Now, of course, clearly they can't offer all of their features for free, which is why I highly recommend if you are going to be building a website with Wix, you should just go ahead and upgrade to the cheapest plan. I honestly don't see any reason why someone wouldn't upgrade to a cheapest plan with Wix. It isn't that expensive per month and you're definitely not going to regret it. So if you do want to do that, of course, check out my link in the description and you can go ahead and pick up a plan at a special discount. That is going to do it for today's video though. So remember to leave a like, subscribe and hit that notification bell and I will see you in the next video.